Adrian, can you please bring your plate? Yes. We have New York strip, potato crumble, cactus pico, with a bone marrow salsa macho over the top. What uh, temperature were you going for on the steak? At home, I eat my steaks rare, and I thought, you know what? My flavors are good. It's seasoned right. Rare is good for me. It's a big risk. The cactus pico, delicious. That little sort of crunch, the texture, the heat coming through at the end. The steak does need another three or four minutes. Once you've got those white marbles or fat still running through there, it just confirms insufficient cooking time. But it feels refined. Thank you, Chef. I think you've captured the Mexican palate in this dish, which I really appreciate. Sure. At the end of the day, this dish shows a lot of potential. Good job. Thank you. Thanks, Eric. Good job, Eric. Thanks, guys. Brandy, please. I've made for you all a cast iron seared venison loin with acorn squash puree, a blackberry demi glace, and the pickled blackberries. How did you season it? Um, I seasoned it with just salt and pepper. I really wanted the venison to shine on its own. Well, five years has made quite a difference in your cuisine because this is a very well-executed dish. The acorn squash is heavenly. It's nutty. It has all those beautiful, silky, smooth characteristics that is a beautiful break from the richness of the venison. Hey, Brandy, you've nailed the venison. It's got that nice, gamey flavor to it. It's cooked beautifully. But I disagree with the judges. Um, the puree is too creamy, so it doesn't taste of acorn. Thank you.